is, is this. Tomorrow night, another chapter of this rivalry. Duke and Carolina, one of the great rivalries, if not the best in all of sports today. But this one is a particularly significant trip across Tobacco Road because this will be Coach K's last ever game in Chapel Hill, and, and so I'm, I'm delighted to have two of, of Coach K's uh, great players with me here today, not just Jay Will, but Jay Billis, who joins us as well. And, and Jay, how, how do we put into words what this means, Coach K going to that place for the last time? Well, it's, a, it's another milestone uh, in his uh, retirement season. I, I don't know that this is going to be quite as emotional as the last game is going to be that's in Cameron Indoor Stadium. And, and look, they could still play in the ACC tournament, too, so it's not necessarily the last time they'll square off. But, uh, you know, there, there's an argument to be made that this will be the last time Coach K sets foot in Chapel Hill because he doesn't go there except for games. <laughs> Uh, so that'll be kind of interesting, and I don't think Carolina is going to have any sort of ceremony from what I've heard, what, from what Jay will uh, mentioned to me this morning on his, his radio show. So uh, it, it'll be more about the game and the rivalry and the competition than it is about Coach K. But that's certainly uh, the undertone of it that this is the last time Coach K the, that Carolina will have a shot to beat Coach K in Chapel Hill, and the last time he'll have a chance to to beat them there. What do you think it means to him, Jay? What 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 do you think this trip means? To Coach K. I do think there's an emotional element because the emotional element will come through the passion that he'll want to win this game. <laughs> like, it, you know, JB talked about this morning. It's about the game and the competitive mindset that he has. But I, I do think for what this rivalry has meant, not only to him, but to the world of college basketball and just in general to all sports, uh, this is a monumental moment. And it's for first place in the ACC. Mm -hmm. So there's something to play for, which he'll always find a reason, but there's a little extra added momentum. It's remarkable when you think about the span of time when he started it was during the you know Dean Smith the legendary legacy there at, at Carolina now all these years later and all of that what how would you describe what this Jay what does a win in North Carolina or against North Carolina mean to him relative to any other win you were there at the very beginning when it first really got going how much more important is this game than any other game on the schedule to coach K well, Coach K, like all coaches will say every game's important, and they try to downplay um, they try to downplay certain certain things. And while this game is no more important than any other game, it's bigger. And and he's he said that to the players. There have been times in the locker room he said, "Hey, this is this is our our system against their system. It's our way against their way." You know, stuff like that. Um, and all the players know it. Everybody knows this is the biggest you know, biggest game you play in. And outside of, of a championship game, an NCAA championship game, Final Four thing, which carries a different kind of significance, this is the game where, where you're remembered how you perform in the Duke Carolina rivalry. Everybody remembers it. And it, it, it's bigger than anything else that they do. And he knows that. I'll give you an example of that, JB. My sophomore year when we won a national championship, you know, considering that we don't really have a professional sports team in that massive radius between the RDU area, mm -hmm. guess what people said to me? Like, North Carolina, oh, we got you that year. Mm. We got you that year, mm -hmm. right? Not about, hey, congratulations on winning a championship. It's, we got you that year. And it's something as a player that you can't run away from because that's all people talk about in that area. By the way, what have you aged? Like 10 minutes? We were making comments this, of this. I had hair then, JB. I had hair. <laughs> you, look, you look exactly <laughs> the same as you did. Jay Billis, we'll see you tomorrow night with that. Jay Will, thank you guys. Thank you. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN Plus right now.